So, how does the new Festo PPS cushioning system actually work? If we look at a standard ISO cylinder cut away in this example here, we can see the piston rod connects through to the piston and on either side of the piston is a cushioning boss so that when the piston moves along the cylinder towards the end cap the cushioning boss will enter into a seal in the end cap. The air that is trapped in the chamber between the piston and the end cap has to exhaust past a small bleed screw which is adjustable in the end cap. In the PPS system this boss is replaced with one with a series of grooves in it and so you can just about see in this example here that there are a combination of V-based grooves and U-shaped grooves. Some of them run the whole length of the boss and some of them only run a partial length of the boss. And what this does is enables some of the air to escape in a proportional rate to the inertia of the cylinder as it moves towards the end cap, compensating and adjusting for the speed and the mass that the cylinder is carrying and enabling a smooth reproducible cushioning adjustment right every time without any adjustment. 